All right, I'm looking a little rough today, but good morning everybody. Today is Monday and it is my last day of college classes. I have two classes today, I think. I'm gonna take you along with me to my classes, although I'm not gonna film my classes because there's a privacy thing. And I also just wanna take you around my day because I have things coming up for finals and things. So it's gonna be a fun little college-y whatever day, even though I'm at home too. <laughs> so my first class of the day is ballet. That's at 8 a.m. and it is currently, please don't be past 7 40 currently 7 43 so i'm gonna stretch a little bit it is freezing cold in my basement right now which is where i'm going to be doing my class but i'm gonna do a nice little warm-up and stretch to get my body moving and to be ready for ballet and then i'm going to change into the clothes that i just got time to change <laughs> She sent the link out. Now I'm just waiting for class to start. So I finished my two morning classes and I think that those are the only classes that I have today. Ballet was okay, it was a little rough. Last week we were preparing for our final and then we had break the week before. So it was kind of rough for me going back to the bar, but it's fine. I, I got through, it was great. And then in my American Musical Theater History class, we prepared for our final. We had a discussion about key concepts, things like that. And now I updated my computer last night to Big Sur. They're like doing a little step-by-step -step guide. So that's what I'm currently doing. Okay, I feel like every single time I film a video, it has something to do with me organizing my room but I did my laundry last night so I'm gonna put my clothes away now <laughs> Wow, the lighting is really nice today. It's been so dark and sad the last couple of days, but it's beautiful out today. Before I do anything else, because I am starving, so I'm gonna make myself some food and then I'm gonna go get some coffee because I want coffee. I'm gonna get dressed and I wanna put on something a little bit nice today because I wanna feel myself, you know? I don't know. Okay, give me a minute, hold on. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. Um, I took out my phone by accident and then I ended up going on TikTok for an hour, but I did finally change. I'm wearing this blue turtleneck and then over it, I have this queen shirt. I'm wearing ripped jeans and Doc Martens. So I did change my outfit. I'm wearing this sweater and now I'm wearing ripped jeans and I am actually going out because I'm kind of feeling a bagel, but we don't have any bagels. So I'm gonna go get a bagel. I'm gonna leave it like this. Yeah, this is good. And I feel like this kind of outfit, it takes an eye to see it, you know? <laughs> Meaning only I can see this outfit put together. I'm getting a bagel, so who really cares? Do I just back up? I can't really see anything. Uh-oh. I'm gonna go. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. Uh, I'm actually a really good driver. Some of my friends might disagree with that, but you know what I say to them? I say I'm an amazing driver. The only thing is when I drive with other people, I can get kind of stressed. I got my coffee. I got a large iced caramel latte because I had a free drink. And so I wanted to get a large because it's free. That is so good. Every time. And I also got two bagels. So now let's head inside and eat lunch. Quick little bagel reveal that I'm gonna eat. so pretty. It is 1.30 on the dot. I'm gonna take some time to plan out my day and plan out some work that I have. You might be like, Thomas, why are you planning your day out? And it's literally 1.30. And the simple answer is, in the mornings I have class and then I take a break for lunch and now I'm ready to do work because I have nothing else to do. I like to use my iPad for work and things. I actually got through the entirety of my senior year of high school using my iPad only. I didn't have any computer. But right now I'm just gonna go through some planning and things like that. So I don't pay for any extra like super expensive apps or anything like that. I just like to use the calendar. So this calendar is actually very tentative right now, but I have on here to film 
today and do some work. I actually have two finals on Thursday. One is for my gen ed class. It's basically about different relationships and communication in them and things like that. It's more of like a reflection type course kind of, but also teaching you skills, I don't know. And I need to outline for my gen ed class and for my American musical theater history class. So I think I'm gonna do that now. So I'll just quickly show you guys. I use the Kindle app for my textbook. I did have a free version of my textbook that I found online that I uploaded into here, but it wasn't the most current. I personally like to type out my notes. It makes it a lot easier to organize my information. And if I do need to go back and look for something, I can just search for it and it'll come right up. So funny story, I realized that I am, well, let's see, the last chapter that I outlined was chapter seven and there are 11 total chapters. Yeah, I'm working on chapter eight now, but it's really not bad. I've gotten really good at outlining, especially for this class. So I'm kind of a pro at outlining at this point. I've done it so much like between high school and now. So I decided I'm going to outline one chapter each day this week leading up to the exam. And then I also outlined two chapters for my American Musical Theater History class. I also have a couple papers due and now I'm going to actually use my iPad to take notes and outline for those. This is hard to do with one hand. Here's a quick tutorial for how to make a fun little heading. <laughs> So you're gonna first get the highlighting tool. This is just the notes app, okay? This is nothing fancy. And you're gonna start by writing out what you wanna write out. And then you're gonna grab the little pen tool. You're gonna write in cursive, lowercase, right over what you just did. As you can see here, you can't see because it hasn't focused yet. On the top, I have the outline with this fun little heading. It's a little funky, but it's kind of cute, I think. This is for my American Musical Theater History class and I have a final paper, but right now I'm gonna do some research and take some notes. So what I'm gonna do is put this side by side. Here I'll read and here I'll take notes. I decided to go to my bed to take notes. I need to lay down. But as you can see, I have these beautiful Christmas decorations up. If you have not already, after you finish this video, go watch my decorating my room with me for Christmas video because I had a lot of fun making that one and I really enjoyed it. So it has been about 10 minutes that I have been taking notes. I went through the textbook and I searched for The Wizard of Oz and I was able to find information about The Wizard of Oz and a little bit about Wicked. Do you like my Mickey Mouse pillow? <laughs> a lot of my work is preparation work for these essays and for my finals. Today I was able to get a good bit done for them. I think that I'm done for work for the day. I'm gonna make myself a nice cup of tea. Let's go do that right now. <laughs> I'm gonna give you some quick dog content. Do you have anything to say <laughs> to anybody? Uh, <laughs> so I'm back in my room, I have my tea. I'm gonna put this down because it is piping hot. But look at the sky. That is so pretty. This outfit would be so much cuter if I could rock a beanie, but I can't wear a beanie. My ears look so weird. It is now 5.20. Okay, you saw. It's 5.24 p.m. We are now nearing the evening, but I'm not quite done with today yet. The last thing I'm going to do school-wise for today, I'm actually going to plan out my schedule for tomorrow. I like to keep it simple. Just write out a couple bullet points for what I need to do. I also do a little bit of digital planning. Something that I did not realize that I literally just learned is that you can actually drag things from a calendar date to another calendar date. By planning out ahead of time and scheduling things for yourself, it can really help you to stay on top of your work and be proactive about doing work because that is something that I've learned even in my first semester that has been super important for college. So that has pretty much been a college day in my life. Today was a pretty easy day. I mean, I just had my two morning classes and I did some work and I was able to get some food and relax a little bit, which was awesome. I'm gonna miss a lot of my teachers and I'm gonna miss a lot of the class dynamics that I have because, you know, it was our first semester. We're all online together. So we really bonded over that. But I am also glad to be done with classes for now. When I get to school, I do wanna do like a day in my life, a week in my life actually on campus because although my school is not fully in person, 
as a musical theater major, I do use some of the facilities and I do think it's pretty cool to see how I go about my day, but stay tuned for that in the future. As for right now, I'm gonna go put something on the TV. Oh my gosh, I feel like I'm in an episode of Euphoria or something. While that's loading, I just wanted to say thank you all so, so, so much for watching this video. Filming these kinds of videos actually help me stay more organized because I'm not gonna lie, some days I sleep in until like 11.45, wake up, do a little bit of work, go to class, and then do nothing for the rest of the evening. But I'm grateful that I was able to have a nice, productive, and fun, a well-rounded day. I'll leave it at that. I really hope that you did enjoy this video. If you did, make sure you give it a thumbs up and leave a comment down below telling me about your major or if you're not in college yet, what you would major in or just an area of interest. Also make sure to subscribe for more videos like this, especially since, as I mentioned, I am planning on making more videos related to my iPad because I love that thing. I wanna share with people how I've used my iPad and what that experience has been because I've gone completely paperless. And again, as I mentioned, once I get back on campus, I wanna make some more of these vlog videos for actual college and I will also have plenty more videos coming soon. And I hope that you all have an amazing day. Peace out.